we actually need an investigation of our our actual rec elected representatives whom we have given the petition to and our DVD and our other reports uh, when we had 1,000 architects and 2,000 architects and engineers calling for a new investigation. We just keep on going every year. We get millions more people involved, like we were able to reach on C-SPAN, fortunately, three million people, and which in a video which has become Washington Journal's uh, number one seen video on that program for C-SPAN. So we are making some headway, Leanne. Absolutely, and the whole motto after 9-11 was never forget. And we will never forget, and we will not let them forget that there is plenty of footage out there, thanks to the internet, thanks to people who are tirelessly chipping away at this. We will never forget 9-11, and we're not going to allow them to shove the official story down our throats so that it just becomes some sort of a meme. Now, very quickly, I think we've got about a minute left. Um, your new movie is going to be premiering uh, September 11th of this year, Firefighters, Architects, and Engineers Expose 9-11 Myths. It's pretty exciting. Uh, we're going to take the myths one by one. We go through a dozen of them, Eric Lawyer and myself together on the stage. Um, we, we highlight, uh, you know, was there, was there only two towers? No. We talk about the third tower that we just mentioned. Um, did, was there raging fires in that third building? No. Uh, is there, was there uh, the uh, correct handling of the evidence? No. Uh, we go through it all in the Twin Towers. Was there, the, has there ever been a fire that's brought down a skyscraper? No, <laughs> it's just not happened. So we go through it all. It's, it's a great method to show the American people and your listeners uh, who, can, who can get this DVD, by the way, on our website, which is ae911truth.org, along with a lot of other evidence that's being used by the 9-11 truth movement because the architects and engineers have the technical credibility mm. that it has been necessary uh, to get the word out to people. They, they tend to get it right away when they hear it uh, from building and technical professionals. Well, thank you so much, Richard Gage, founder of Architects and Engineers for 9-11 Truth. We sincerely appreciate it. We'll talk to you soon. Thanks so much, Leanne.